all the girls wanna try Ooh, don't spray flexin', no stressin', I'm the king of the gang From coast to coast, you know they Us, good YouTube, it's your boy Thoroughbred Gaming And we is back with another video today Today, today Got Black Ops 6 And, man, listen This game right here Takes us back to the BO2 days, Black Ops 1 days, and this campaign story takes place in the 90s. We got Russell Allen on the run because the CIA framed him for being a mole. Black Ops 6, man. We here for it finally. So we gonna see what the story is about and see how it takes place. This game though, I think BO6 gonna get back to the P. Back to the P times of BO1, BO2 days. Everything was just great. So now we gotta see. If it's gonna bring us back to the community all the way. So without further ado, let's get back into this and see what's popping. Let's go. I think I'm gonna do uh I don't even know. Regular hardy. Popping. Are you denying that? We have discussed what it all. What more do you want, Livingston? Enough! You disobeyed a direct order, Mr. Marshall, when it was clear your op was compromised. With all due respect, sir, you weren't there. And the group that compromised you, the Pantheon. You sure that's who they were? That's what Alawi called them. When are you going to tell us what's really going on here? I'm asking the questions, Mr. Woods. Sir, if you read the report, you... I read your report, Ms. Harrow. Some of it I still find hard to believe. That's why we're going to go over events again. Only this time, I want to hear it from Marshall. From the beginning. We were in position... The game kind of dark. We talking to Biden? near the Iraq Kuwait border. Small team, me, Harrow, and Case. Allow he is ahead of schedule. Whoever he's meeting won't wait around for long. No. Not if it's a smuggler. I'm sure Allow he's paid top dollar to get himself out of the Middle East. Guess it doesn't really matter. 
He's coming with us. Outlaw 42, we've got our eyes on the convoy. Outlaw 42, you're clear to engage. Out. Let's go get him. Copy, ground. Mr. Marshall. The group you claim to be the Pantheon. All right, my bad, y'all. I'm back. My bad, y'all. Was a multinational, heavily armed paramilitary force that showed up out of the blue. At this point, you're told to wait for backup, but you decide to play cowboy instead. We had to act fast. Our window was closed. Harold, did he or did he not disobey your order? Yes, sir, but the accelerated timetable... That's what I thought. I've come to expect this from you. But not from you. Sir, our objective was to recover Alawi by any means necessary... Oh, I'm but... aware. So, care to explain why he's on a slab in the morgue right now? Things got... complicated. <laughs> Things got... former European and U.S. deputies. I don't know who leads them. They're blocking our access now. The call and reinforcements are waiting. What the hell with that? Barrage coming. We're headed your way. I'm going with you. Damn it, Troy. It's your man. Hey, so let's start by softening them up. Equipment wheel. Equip and swap your carry items to customize your loadout. Press and hold up on to open the equipment wheel and then equip lethal types of support items in the associated slots. Let's 
could be leading us into an ambush. It's the only way out. Baraj, we're getting close. Baraj, come in. Are you sure he'll be there? You just worry about not slowing us down. We're open targets down here. And they'll could pick us apart. Oh, this remind me of bro with the uh oh this must be the character that's in Monty. This must be the We got no cover, bro. You could be leading us into an ambush. It's the only way out. Baraj, we're getting close. Baraj, come in. Are you sure he'll be there? You just worry about not slowing us down. We're open targets down here. Yeah, they have to pick us apart. They got high ground like a motherfucker. You could be leading us into an ambush. That's three times. It's the only way out. Barash, we get close. Barash, come in. Are you sure he'll be there? You just worry about not slowing us down. Sniper, We're open targets down here. And they'll get pick us apart. They're behind cover! What? He didn't even Alright. Wait till you want to see some loaded in. Goddamn, watch what happened. 
Woods' new project. You can ease up, son. I'm all done here. He put that boy Jane. in the dirt. You just killed a high-value target in cold blood. And put our national security at risk. Well, we can't fall into the Pantheon's hands. Or Langley's. The CIA is compromised. But it's not me. I'm just the fall guy. You expect us to believe that? Hey, Jane, you want to tape his mouth shut for me? Yes. Wait. I got a message for Woods. Oh, yeah? Tell him Bishop takes Brock. Tell him that's supposed to mean. Despite breach of conduct and losing Alawi, apprehending Russell Adler is a categorical windfall. Yes, Ms. Harrow. Bringing in a rogue operative is certainly a win. Russell Adler, the mole who betrayed us in Panama. The man responsible for your current condition, Mr. Woods. <laughs> so why was he trying to tell you something in Kuwait? Bishop takes Rook. Any idea what that means? No clue. Okay, then. Based on Harrow's reluctant report and the withholding of critical information regarding Russell Adler, your team is suspended. Are you for real? It's bullshit. As for you, Miss Harrow, consider yourself on very, very thin ice. People like me and Adler are the reason we ain't speaking Russian right now. The Cold War is over. Mr. Woods, that makes you and Russell Adler the last global gunslingers of a bygone era. Take this time to reflect on that. Dismissed. All of you. My office in five. I'd advise you not to pursue this further, Marshal. Livingstone is a, a corn mold. <laughs> Are you admiring your own work? Can't believe you kept it. Not all reminders need to be scars. <clears throat> Why are we here, Harrow? Did something? Care to tell me what it is you're up to? I mean, the kids just need some time away. Take a little trip. Reflect a little. Look, I can cover your asses on my end best I can. But if things go sideways again, you're on your own. Copy that. Oh, you want? One? Yeah, try a dozen. Do me a favor, Troy. Don't get yourself killed. I'll see what I can do. I feel like they had a thing going on. That's the vibes I'm getting. Even though they like business partners or, or Bishop takes Rook. Of course Woods knew what it meant. Abbott was pointing us somewhere. The Black Sea. According to Woods, 15 years ago, he and Adler discovered an abandoned KGB safe house in Bulgaria. It was called the Rook. Last year, before Abner disappeared, he'd been chasing rumors of a dangerous paramilitary group when receiving orders from inside the CIA. He believed the Pantheon was developing a new type of weapon, a 
plans to unleash something the world had never seen before. He went to it. Soon evidence surfaced incriminating Adler himself, and he fled to this place. What we found here over the last couple days has changed everything. Now I'm questioning what I believe about Adler, about Livingston, about the CIA itself. I have my doubts about going dark on Jane. Woods might be right about her value on the inside, but she'll be in the crosshairs if Langley learns what we're up to. Adler brought us here for a reason, to stop the Pantheon before they strike. To do that, Woods believes we'll need him back. It won't be easy. But Adler left the name to follow. It's a good place to start. Hey, these are movies, old Fardo! No more wasting time. We you know the plan. Dumas, Dumas, the person you're gonna meet. Still no idea why Adler was in contact with her, but he needs a lead. I can't trust her. I doubt if Adler did. Hell, for all we know, she's probably part of this fucking pantheon. Too. Yeah, that's true. Who can we trust? Dumas agreed to meet Case in Avalon, so we're doing this. Well, uh, look at you putting your big boy pants on. Shouldn't we find Adler before making this call? Well, that's exactly why I'm going to Munich to run and dine your old friend. Friend? Hardly. I can't stand the son of a bitch. But we need him. Sometimes you just gotta hold your nose. If he's as good as you say he is, by the time Case gets back, we'll have located Adler. If Livingston doesn't already stuffed him in a barrel. Our details are up on the board case. I'm headed out, so hit me up soon if you need anything. I've got a few ideas on how we can polish this turd of a safe house case. Let's talk when you have a minute. That's a long case. Gosh. What's going on, man? Just what we found in Adler's files. An assassin, maybe 30 years old, came from one of Avalon's crime factions, the Guild. The assassin? Appears she was raised through the Guild and then exiled or left, don't know. Whatever it is, Adler was interested, so I am too. So far, we've got nothing but Adler's homework. But he could be out of his mind. Whether he is or whether he isn't, those paramilitaries in Kuwait, they were the real deal. Well-armed, coordinated, and motivated. Felix Newman's a former Stasi engineer and enforcer. He managed to crack the military branch of Arpanet a few years back, so I'm hoping he's got a sequel in him. Worried? Jane's smart. Once Lingley knows we've skipped town, she'll make excuses for us as long as possible. Until then, comms are going to put a target on our head, so we'll wait for the time to be right, and then we'll regroup. I'm not worried. No. Hell, man, I don't know. Seems hard to believe, but maybe I'm just naive. If Livingston's involved, he could have wanted to add it off the board one way or the other. The man both loves and hates being told what to do. That's a tough motherfucker in there. Lost his legs in Panama, lost his best friend. Mainly gave him a chance to help run ops, but between me and you, it's not in his blood. Man's a soldier, killer. This current situation, maybe he feels like he's on the front line again. You got it. See you back here on Thursday. <sighs> All right. 
What kind of life savings you got? Ah, <laughs> uh, no wonder you're still alive, Case. Always <laughs> serving up the top sirloin of bullshit. I'm gonna cut to it. We can't do shit with this house, considering our money situation. This place might have been fine for Adler, but for a team? I'm thinking overhaul. An armory. Place to train. Gear bench. Not to mention anything else we might end up needing. There's that won't be free, though. We were following an old KGB trail, and a single recording led us here. Seemed abandoned. When we asked our mole inside the KGB about it, he knew nothing. Belikov thought maybe it was some kind of splinter group, not sanctioned by the Central Committee. Whatever it was, it doesn't look like a red-stepped foot in here since 1968. Marshall found a few grand stashed in one of the rooms upstairs. Other than that, we're starting fresh. No touching our own bank accounts either. Someone will be watching. When you're on a mission, look around for any cash lying around. You're gonna Robin Hood your way through this. Steal from the rich and give to the poor. That's me. Yeah, I don't think he wanted to get others involved. Looks like he was working on a trust list. As far as I could tell, we didn't contact anyone. That's probably why Adler was talking to Dumas. Keeping it outside of Langley. We're gonna do the same. At least for now. The board behind me is how we'll track our spending. Give it a look. Any money found during missions can be used to build out three new stations in the safe house. Each will allow you to acquire operator perks, making you deadlier in the field. Just tell me where you want to spend the cash, and I'll set it up. Got this going. Like Marshall said, your mission details are on the board over there. Operator perks. Money found during mission can be used to purchase new operator perks, boosting your combat skills, physical resilience, and equipment loadout. Some have additional tier to advance them further. Okay. We only got 200 right now. I, I kind of like this. Oh, they don't like guns. They're out I like this. I like this. This, this, this is, is hard. This is tough, for real. Like, this is different than, you know, you know, you know you play the game, you, you, you uh, pick up guns that you find on the ground, or you start out with weapons that they give you, whether, you know, it's a sniper and a machine gun, uh, assault rifle, SMG, whatever. Uh... I like this though. This isn't like the typical traditional of Black Ops, but it's kind of like a new direction in a sense. But it's dope. It works with it. And then you got gear station, which we have to buy those and then drink it. So we're gonna start with. Uh, I think we should start with how much is two cables and three stuff? About thirty percent. Carry one additional mask. Get it popping. Next mission. What do you say? Uh, thank you for killing that lead to an alpha, alpha, while 
helping Savati be much nuclear efficient. Adler didn't leave much intel on Savati Dumas, but I can tell you a thing or two about Avalon. It's a playground for the filthy rich. The crime factions run the whole city. Everyone's looking for who to push it off the slide. When they pick a target, they hire someone like Savati. She used to be part of the guild, one of the most powerful Avalon factions. But now she freelances. Savati said that Adler hired her to follow a Pantheon trail. So you're gonna join her on that job tonight. We want to see firsthand where that trail leads. Maybe we'll even add some muscle to the team. You'll scratch your back. Sure as hell, watch your own. Trust is gonna be earned. for the guild. He'll be on his yacht tonight taking a call with the Pantheon. We'll be listening in. Once that call is finished, you'll finish Yannick. That'll draw the target I really want. But first things first. Close enough to know if you screw this up. Organic traffics and weapons, narcotics, women, whatever pays. Rumor has it the Pantheon wants a relationship with the Guild, so Yannick is testing the waters. He's only our first domino. The real fun starts after we knock him down and get access to the target I really want, Johannes Edi. The bell tower on that church offers an open view of Yannick's yacht. He's throwing a party while his men count money in the church. Let's see what you're made of, Chase. Get to the bell tower. I don't care uh, how. Quiet, uh, loud, just get there. Uh, I'm about to say I love him. Good hands. You could go for a swim. Avoid some guards. Stop. I'm about to say, I love a... Uh, uh, a cyber. Love a, uh, a I don't like Hope you can pick a lock. Once we listen to Yannick's call and confirm a Pantheon lead for Adler, I'm declaring open season on the Guild. They have it coming. I should know. I used to work for them when I was with the Guild. Though they were good practice in how to blend into a scene. And a girl who caught Yannick's eyes with him for a long night. So let's cut this short. Ah, that club sheet. Typical Yannick. The water really carries the music.
That church case. The trolls look pretty light on the sides. You could probably slip through. a call from Pantheon any minute. Counting it, it's all there. Remember, this deal is one and done. Huh? Don't need to get mixed up with the CIA. Oh, your pantheon thing. You'll send the hardware tonight, understand? That's not what we agreed to tonight, Yannick. Don't test me. So the pantheon and the CIA are connected somehow. We got what we need. Take the shot. Shoot them! Bro, what? Who's Yannick, bro? I can't... Uh, oh. We got what we need. Take the shot. Yannick was just our first domino. We have more work to do tonight. Head back towards the payphone. I'll pull up in the white van. What? Hold on, hold on. Guards inbound. Word on your uh, Did y'all just see what happened to Wody? Hold on. Did y'all just see what happened to Wody, bro?
No, that was crazy. I don't know if that hold on. No, that was crazy. No. How do you Bro? You know it's so great, it's cool. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Don't let them escape! an emergency meeting at Chateau de la Haute Lune. Three guild leaders will be in attendance to smooth things over with Pantheon. I want to get paid, so we're going to crash that party. Chateau de la Haute Lune, let's go! The guild will lock the restaurant down and meet in a safe room on the second floor. Door can only be unlocked from the inside. You're gonna help me get that door open. We're a few minutes out yet. Just enough time to get changed. Maybe on. Fits for guild security. Personally, I want these guild bastards dead. And the only thing is on the cake for me. This is my stop. Get to the safe room's antechamber on the second floor. An alarm will go off. That's okay. The guild doesn't know you. So your best option? is to surrender and play along. When you get inside, wait for my cue. The guild is meeting Pantheon right now. Get inside and find the safe room. Of all the guild assholes meeting tonight, the Sadie is the biggest. If we can't get them, consider me a no for your little club. Wine was shit. Why'd I have an extra gift? they're done meeting upstairs. Ah, come on, please, of course.
can drink after they're done meeting upstairs. After me. Gotta kill both of them with a headshot. Got you, got you, got you. We can drink after they're done meeting upstairs. Ah, come on, live it in <sighs> I'm going out for a smoke. Don't be gone for long. They told us to stay here. C'est quoi ça? Ennemi dans la zone. Canardez-les. Crazy work. Mm, we can drink after they're done meeting upstairs. Ah, come on, little. Bro, dang. I keep messing that up. Drink after they're done meeting upstairs. Ah, come on, leave it in. I'm going out for a smoke. Don't be gone for long. They told us to stay here. Some. CIA types are all the same. And this one? <laughs> Troublemaker. What's going on in there? We have a visitor. Walked right into the lion's den. Alone. <laughs> Uninvited. Maybe this one works for a rival, huh? Or maybe, maybe Pantheon is trying to squeeze us. We came to you, Asaini. We'll learn the truth one way. <laughs> or another. Go ahead. Well, look at that. You're a long way from home, Case. This man is extremely dangerous. Kill him immediately. Now go. Actors don't even recognize me. Not a 
luggage with Sable. Shields. Stop peeking me so close to me. That's my fault. The government men will make it easy to say they will stop down on the meat ship. I'm sure, please. You beat the best. Some of these bastards are packing. Shoot coming down the street. Nice work on Sigil. That just needs a safety. Where is the safety? Check the street! Limo's coming down the street. Oh, 
to that serve yet, but hey, at least we didn't get killed in our sleep. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna stop right here. This is tough. Is safe. Newman's been cranking all night. Already got something. Come on. All right, Newman. Care to share? Please, call me Felix. We are all friends here. Yeah, of course. Russell Adler is in your Washington, D.C. black site. The subterranean one that went into operation almost three years ago. D.C. black site? There are blueprints as well. It is located underneath Capitol Station. I assume you're aware of this. I see. It includes a small maximum security wing that is where you'll find your prize. We need a game plan. You mean right? I wouldn't be sitting here if I wasn't. I'll take that. Newman. Felix. I need to wait into that black site. I'm still investigating vulnerabilities. Good man. Let me know when you got something, okay? Man, that's a lot to unpack for the first episode. That is a lot to unpack. See that Adler is on the run from the CIA as they formed him the cold at the end of that campaign. They started fresh here in B06. And now we may see there's a connection between Pentagon and the CIA. This right this one right here is more like a I don't wanna say open world, but it do got open world type. Kinda has an open world feel too. Not Totally open world, but kind of single world with the missions and kind of what you can explore and things of that nature, man. But I'm enjoying this. And then, like, when you kill the big bosses and stuff like that, the bully, like the hitman or something, fucks with that. I'm not messing with that. That's fire for sure. Listen, man. Hey. BO6 might have brought it back. You know what I'm saying? And do all the stuff about upgrading the safe hours and getting better guns. I like that too. That, that's tough. But listen, man. If y'all want more content like this, I, man, I'm enjoying this campaign so far. We're gonna get back into it next week. Next, uh, next episode. This was a great, great, great intro to the campaign. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button. Let me know what y'all, what y'all think y'all in the comments. Be sharp as a sword. I'm knowing, I'm knowing I gotta keep going. Nobody the problem might have to eat heavy as I know I gotta keep going. Going hard so I'm hard to avoid.